Good morning, y'all. I don't know if you can even see this. Ah, uh, you probably can't. But anyway, this tent is... It's just covered with dust. I assume it's pollen. And I would equally assume it's probably off the spruce trees. But walking yesterday under spruces, when the sun would shine, you could just see the dust. It's like you were on a dirt road. Oh well, if y'all know what it is, let me know. Alright. We're on trail. We got on trail about a quarter after eight this morning. Thought I'd get past that one real muddy spot before I started chatting with you. And uh, I suspect the lens is fogging up a bit. It's really not that foggy. But you guys will be alright. <sighs> it's uh, quite lovely out here. We're now getting up into some pine thickets, or actually pine plantations. Sorry about that. I'm trying to get the lens wiped off a little bit. The trail's not in too bad a shape, actually. It's muddy, but not that uh, stuff that you sink into your knees in it. We should get a little better view here of the pines. Right, let me see if I can wipe this off. It's a little bit better. Got pretty nice stepping stones in here. It's a beautiful morning. The low last night was 47. And it's now in the low 50s. Feels kind of humid. Which is weird, but... Really not a huge chance of rain today, though. I think they're going to call it less than 20%. Huckleberry blooms. Those babies will be getting ripe in another couple months. Uh, well, I'll see y'all later. Getting close to where I'd thought about camping last night. These meadows are just gorgeous in here. Ciao. It's just a beautiful grove of pines in here. This was one of my campsite destinations. I don't think anybody was even camped here last night. There may have been, who knows. To get to camp on all these beautiful pine needles makes a pretty nice bed. I'm thinking right there. Yep, I should have went on ahead and walked this far. Damn. It's probably only about a 20 minute walk. But it would have sucked that I got here and it was already occupied. But I could have found somewhere else to camp. That's where we came from, and that's where we're going.
Ciao. We are now on Blackbird Knob Trail for a short distance, maybe a quarter of a mile, maybe. And we'll peel off of that and take Rocky Ridge, who knows how far. Ciao. boss, meaning me, said it was time to give us, me, myself, and I, a morning break. This is actually a beautiful spot right here. Man, is it exposed to the wind. Let's see, what is the time? 10.30. I'm going to walk a little over two hours. We probably come, let me turn this around. Maybe a little bit more. Well, time to eat. Let you go. Lunch. I never eat spam at home. I don't want to ruin it for myself when I'm out here. This is a nice spot. I've actually camped here before. There's like a little sandy area right there. Wind about blew me off the mountain that night. Me and Ivy, actually. Ciao. I get down Raven Ridge Trail to Dobbin Grade. I'll have 2.8 more miles. I've already done, let's see, five. Maybe a little more than five. After that, we'll look for somewhere to camp for the night. Ciao. Yeah, he's still down. I'm not entirely sure how to put it back up to stay. I doubt that it would stay. Not sure how much battery I got left. Probably more than I had in that other battery. Once again, the wind's blowing. Forgive me. Or not. We're not well. We've been on Raven Ridge Trail. We're going to continue on it. I don't know where we're going. It's, uh... It's not even 2 o'clock yet. I'll soon have done 8 miles. Damn. Not bad for an old chick. Ciao. It's quarter to 4. Camp is set up for the night. We're on a campsite off of Upper Red Creek Trail. Not exactly my choice of choices, but it gets me out of some of the wind, um, and it's about probably less than a three mile hike out tomorrow. So, nice place. Yep, let you go. Good evening. Yeah, I'm in the tent. It's comfy in here. Although I have to admit, after my fall on Friday, I'm hurting tonight. I've even taken a couple of leaves today, which I don't normally take pain stuff, but that's an injury that I cannot seem to uh, heal up. About the time I heal up, almost, I fall and re injure it. Yeah, no, quit falling. I wonder if you can hear that one bird. That one. I don't know if you could hear it or not, but if you know what that bird is, please let me know. I love that bird. Makes me think of my mom. Uh, well, I'll close out tonight. 
And I'll give you a look out the door. And ciao.